Let's calculate the volume of this shape. What we have here is a half cylinder as well as a nice rectangular prism. So we know how to calculate the volume of this box. So we have here the volume of this shape is equals to volume of the half cylinder plus the volume of the box. Now we know what the volume of the box is. The volume of the box is sim simply length times width times height. So the volume of the box is equals to 10 times 16 times 25, which we can use our calculator to figure out. Let's find the volume of the half a cylinder. So it's going to be one half the volume of a cylinder, which happens to be the area of a circle times the uh, length here. So the area of a circle is going to be pi r squared, and the, the length would be 25. Now the question is, what is our r value? What is the r value from here to here? Now it's going to be half of 16, which is 8. So this r value is going to be 8. So let's uh, use our calculator to crunch this out. So we're going to calculate this uh, half cylinder volume, which is 1 half. 0.5 is the same thing as 1 half times pi. There's pi over there. And r is 8. 8 times 8 is 64. So times 64 times 25. So we have this volume of a half cylinder is equals to approximately 2513.27. Now let's work out this volume of the box. We have 10 times 16 times 25. This here is 4,000. So we have the volume of the box, check 4,000, and we have the volume of the half cylinder, which is this number here, and we simply add them together. So I'm going to take this answer 4,000, and I'm going to go plus, let me find that this answer here. Press enter twice and we have the final volume. So the volume is equals to 6513.3 approximately. And when we look at our choices, choice A would be the right answer.